board. So I've asked the question, what if you, what if it was nothing you know, what if the counseling beliefs, the observer, feel the feelings, everything you're trying doesn't seem to work? Um, for myself, um, uh, I just look at it this way. There's a few th ways I look at it when nothing, nothing works. Is that, um, let's say I'm trying to surrender, I'm trying not to resist. Um, I'm, tr I'm trying to observe and nothing's working. Then for me, the, there is a there is something, uh, Hawkins talked about something called karmic undoing. It's like where everything you use doesn't work, even though it seems to work all the time, but sometimes at a certain point, nothing that you do, you try and do the observer and that's not working. Then you start canceling it to death, that didn't work. Then you try not to resist it and just to let it be there and that's not working, and nothing's working. And Hawkins said there's a type of karma where you'd have to see what happened in this lifetime or prior lifetime, where you're blocked from using any of the tools. The tools don't, won't work. It's like grace, and it's like, it's, uh, um, I call it karmic undoing. Hawkins calls it something in um, I writing in subjectivity, it's a specific type of karma, where you just have to let it, run its course until that's paid off um, through, you have to experience it out. You're not allowed to just float off into bliss or do, for it to disappear. Um, and there's a reason why, but it's like, though that is a specific type of karma. So even though you normally you can just disappear it with the observer or just cancel it out, sometimes you're blocked from using those tools and it's like, and you are you are spiritually growing. It's just that you can't get rid of it. Uh, it just has to run its course. And all the things that would work and always do work are, are not working. And uh, you'd and then if you're able to recall the past life or whatever and see what guilt was there and that uh, it's almost like there's a choosing that you will undo that. Um, that thing that happened through actually experiencing it without relief. And so there's that. So I would just say, I'm trying everything. It's just like I'm having to go through this. And I, I would just, uh, I would, ex and Hawkins talked about it. He, he made a joke about it on a different level in a different place. But I do remember it, it was quite funny. He said, like, uh, one day you find out that your wife has left you for another man and taken the Mercedes with you with you and he goes well if that happens he said well just say that pays that karma off and laugh and let it go you know that's just um so i just go well you know it's hard to laugh sometimes but you're paying off a karma that you have to just pay off and it will pass and you are doing spiritual work so that's how i contextualize that you know uh, it's not like um is there any i mean you know you can do there, there's other things i could say but that would be on a long or the other lines, like um, you could not resist it, go to the observer, cancel it. <clears throat> you could go to a spiritual group or a mentor and ask if they can find out something that you're not trying. Sometimes if you go to a spiritual, a spiritual group, sometimes if you go to a spiritual, I'll let that phone run, run off, uh, go to a group, uh, a miracle, like something you haven't tried will be revealed to you. Or if you go to a spiritual teacher, or sometimes the group will pray for you. And even though you can't, something will happen there. So those are the things I'd say on, on what if everything you're trying is not working.